This is the story of the Selkie wife. Selkies are this magical being in Shetland that look like a seal, but under a full moon on a secluded beach, they'll come up to the shore, strip off their seal skins, and they reveal these beautiful human forms underneath, and they'll revel there on the beach under the moonlight. Well, this story starts at one such occasion, when the Selkies were dancing on the sandy shores in the Shermel. But what they didn't realise was there was a fisherman there who'd been working late at the banks, and he saw them dancing, and he fell in love with one Selkie woman who was so beautiful with her long silvery hair. He watched them dance the entire night, until the moon set and the sun began to rise over the hills, and suddenly, one by one, each Selkie put their skin back on and dove back into the sea in seal form. And this fisherman couldn't stand the idea of never seeing this woman again, that he snuck onto the beach and he stole her skin and hid it. So in the end, she was the only Selkie person left on the beach, walking up and down, looking for her skin. She started to cry because without her seal skin, she can never again go beneath the waves. And that's when the fisherman came and comforted her, put his jacket around her, and took her home to look after her. The fisherman and the Selkie wife were married and had a family of two bairns. And the fisherman loved her and she dearly loved her bairns, but she never loved the fisherman the same as he cared for her, for her true home was in the sea. But one day, when the fisherman was off, working on the croft, her two bairns had been playing in the byre, in the barn, and they ran in to show their man the seal skin they'd found hidden up in the beams of the roof. And she took the seal skin and she smiled. And the bairns both said they'd never seen their mother look as happy as that moment. And then she looked in at them, she hugged each of them tightly, and then ran. She ran all the way down to the sea, and the fisherman saw her running down the hill, hiding on to the skin, and he realised what was about to happen, so he chased. He ran to the edge of the beach, and he got there just in time to watch, as with a second glance, she slipped the skin on and dove again into the waves to return to her home once more.